Hello to another episode of How to Build Good in Minecraft. I'll be explaining how to build a basic house. So, I have this shape so far. This normal square and a jut jut out square. What I'll be talking about is basically how to how to build a basic house. So, let's first talk about the roof. So, if I go here to slab, I'm going to choose for jun I mean jungle slab here. I'm doing building and working on a house for Minecraft. So if you see here, what I'm going to do, oops, not that. I'm going to put this. Whenever it's a full block, it looks like a full block, these slabs, I'll, I put this there. I'm basically making basic jet out roof that's attached to this main building. Work on the actual main thing. So, what I like to do for the roof is find the longer part of the building and put the pyramid on the on the more um, thinner part of the pyramid of the uh, building. So this will be the pyramid area here. See, and this is that. Now you see this is the not a the width. This is the width, so I like to put the area where it, this part here on the width part, for example, like that, where the pyramid shape on the house, the triangle shape, not pyramid, but the triangle shape is here, and I like to have a window in the front, for example, like this. Have this using fences instead of glass is a technique for building and here's another technique I like to show you for like stuff like shutters I like to use trap doors like this so it makes a basic um, shutter look to it And now, you can see that I made a pretty basic house. You can also, on the sides, do it where it's like this. Windows on the sides, if you like. And another technique is to put it. The, um, put a stone type block near the edge near the bottom that makes a, a um, nice thing. What I recommend for like lighting is actually lanterns, as you can see here. So now it's kind of brighter. Same here. This, I actually have a technique for this. If I go here and do chest, huh, and I place this sideways, that's good for making a bigger storage. So elongating a chest like this is there for stuff and I'm basically making the interior this is actually I think the first interior in the series now yeah this now I recommend for like these edges for the floor for the walls the edging stone part for the walls having the floor the same I also have another technique if you do this like this and put this 
which is kind of like a uh, part of like when you go in. Looks like an outside area. But I'm going to finish up this floor now. I'll show you another trick. Another tip. So yeah. So, if you see here on the corners, I'm using granite right now. You can use whatever stone block you like or any block. But in the corners here, you can you can do this in the corners. So it makes it not too repetitive, as you can see right here. It breaks up the repetitiveness of this. You can also do a pattern like this. X-shaped pattern. There. I did a pattern shape for the floor. I'm also going to show you another trick. So if I get a sign and a bed and I put this bed like right here I hold shift and I place a sign on the side kinda looks like the end of the bed a thing at the end of the bed well, let me see if I do this there and I do this that's for that for the basic stuff, anyway, when you start out for a world, I'm, I think you, what you should do is probably do an area for all your furnaces, like this. And maybe have an anvil right there. So yeah, this is pretty basic housing, and um, another thing I want to show you, let's see here, carpet, carpet, oh, it must be in wool, near wool, yep, it is, so if you see here, if I do this, I can actually make a pattern here. try to do a very random pattern. You see here, this kind of looks like a carpet. Actual carpet. So yeah. Um, that's some of the basic tips I have on the interior design of the house. And for the outside, what I like to do for the outside where the door is, is put a torch here near the middle. And for a wall you could actually do this. As you can see here, it's kind of crumbled up. Randomized and crumbled up wall. And maybe we can put some flowers here. Just like this. And now, we have a little garden here. And let me put some doors here. There's also another trick I have. If you do this, it will look like that for the front which is kind of flat. If you go right here on the edge of the block and put it here, this door looks like it's in a little bit. So if you see here, it's in. There's more depth to the whole thing. 
That's some of the tips I have for building a basic house. Well, that's all I have for today of building a pretty basic house. Well, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next episode. Goodbye.